you are such an amazing person but one thing do you need to know love yourself accept who you are appreciate who you are and affirm yourself and remember being an amazing and a wonderful person you come across challenges there are people who may not accept you there are people who reject you there are people who may not uh, agree with you but remember you are very useful person and how do you deal with challenges definitely you come across challenges people will discourage you will deceive you depress you but you need to be able to deal with whatever comes on your way because you are an amazing person hi how are you this is shabi hamulengia the author of the book you have a bright future do not give up secret for the singles and men are crying women are weeping uh thank you welcome to this channel please if you can subscribe to our youtube channel share our messages and uh comment tell me what you'd like me to talk about you're such an amazing person i value you you have a lot to share with me today we'll be talking about how do you deal with breakup indeed when you start a relationship you have a lot of expectation and you believe that all will be well but sometimes things may not go the way you planned and when things don't go the way you planned you need to remain strong you need to accept it's not yet your end you need to believe that this is a new beginning how you deal with breakup will define and will determine how you live your life there are people who went through breakup and they lost hope and other went through breakup they don't want even to talk about relationship but you need to be strong when they let you down don't remain down you need to be able to rise up and one thing i want to tell you that breakup is normal and i will tell you better a failed relationship a failed relationship that a bitter marriage uh the reason why i wrote the book men are crying women are weeping is because i have come to realize that many people who are in marriages they are crying and they are weeping and one of the reason some were not able to make a wise decision so when you fail in a relationship that does not mean you are a failure you need to be able to encourage yourself comfort yourself sometimes you feel like you have lost but when you lose don't lose hope and don't get lost because this and that happen you feel like uh, you're a loser no you're not a loser in fact many people some of us who went through hard time and relationship who were rejected but thank god and i keep saying that the person who is leaving you is leaving for someone else a better one and that's something that you need to believe and don't let the breakup make you bitter don't be bitter after breakup because when you are bitter you be blinding yourself when you are bitter you not be able to see clearly when you are bitter you not be able to to see you not be able to start and you not be able to achieve in other words you get lost bitterness fight bitterness and learn to forgive and be free when you forgive you feel well when you forgive you be able to focus when you forgive you be able to find the joy when you forgive you be able to fulfill even your dream so it is not your end because of a breakup you need to be able to be strong when they leave you love yourself when someone is leaving you love yourself learn from the situation also let go the past and live with hope and that's very important that you need to live with hope you need to love yourself you need to learn from the situation and let go the past it's key i know that uh, when you have broken when a relationship is no longer there it's over 
You need to accept it. You are not the first person going through that situation. Many went to the land, and there are people who started the first relation, second, the third, and the fourth. They were kind of failing, but the fifth one, they made it. So it's you're not the first one. So it's not yet your end. You have a bright future. And you need to believe. And what you tell yourself matters a lot. And you don't change your attitude. And don't let the relationship, a failed relationship, change your attitude towards men or women. There are people who think, ah, I don't I can't trust men. Uh, no, I, I can't. No. They are great and wonderful men. They are wonderful women outside there. So if this one left you, it does not mean, oh, you are unlucky. Oh, no. You are blessed. And you remember you deserve the best. If this one left, means that, that the best one is coming. The beautiful one are coming. So be strong. In fact, when you encourage yourself, when you are able to see success, in the middle of failure, that's the time you're able to stand. So, don't hurt yourself. Don't regret. Rejoice. Because something great and good is happening. So, I say when they leave you, love yourself. And listen to yourself. Let go. Live with hope. And that will be able to help you. Don't be bitter because bitterness will not help you. Also, when... After breakup, you need to be able to think right. Try to reason. Don't rush. There are some people after breakup, they want to rush. It's like, I must be in another relationship. No. <laughs> you need to relax. Relax. And uh, research. In other words, try to help yourself. You need healing. And uh, remain focused and don't lose focus. Say, no, I think, yes, you can take a break, but remain focused. And uh, you need to renew your strength and know that uh, breakup is not your end. So don't change your attitude. Uh, don't change your association. And also don't change your action. In other words, don't. There are people, because of the breakup, they end up doing the wrong thing. Don't abuse yourself because of a person who left you. I say better a failed relationship than a bitter marriage. So don't lose hope. The problem, the big problem that people uh, go through is losing hope. When you lose hope, you'll not be able to start and stand and succeed. But live with hope that great and wonderful things are coming on my way. I'm expecting the best. That's the reason why you should not give up. And you are not a failure. And as you count yourself as a winner. Yes. I, I remember when I personally went through a failed relationship. I, I was grateful because my prayer, I knew that God has the best. And God surprised me. In other words, blessings are still there. That is not your the last person in the world. Blessings are still there. They are coming. And uh, don't limit God. Don't think that it's over. It's not yet over. Great. And uh, your miracle is coming. So that's the reason why you need to relax. Uh, when they reject you, don't reject yourself. When they reject you, someone, the best is going to receive you. Now, what do you do after breakup? Well, I will suggest like uh, four things that you need to do. Take it easy. Take it easy. It's not yet your end. Second thing, talk to people. Learn. If you can go for counseling and you can talk, don't hide it. Accept it. It has happened. And so you need to be able to cope with it. And uh, talk to, look for someone who can be able to encourage you, advise you, share your heart out, and also think right. Uh, in other words, you need to be able to see a bright future ahead of you. 
and uh, get busy. You need to be, uh, don't let your mind worry, fear, or don't scare yourself. Oh, who will uh, again? Who will marry me? Who? Yes. The, okay. So take your time. Also, try not to, to abuse. Don't abuse yourself. In other words, don't take the wrong step. So, what I can tell you about breakup is a normal thing. It's happened to people. But the strong people will be able to learn. Learn from your past mistake. And uh, the best teacher is your last mistake. We all make mistakes. But uh, don't be bitter because of your mistakes. Because we are in a learning process. Life is a learning process. So, love yourself. And... Uh, be courageous enough. Don't change your attitude because of what happened. But you need to remain strong and know that it shall be well. Encourage yourself. And don't be bitter. Forgive and focus. And find the reason of living. And there are people who do the wrong thing. That person, your life is not in someone's hand. Your life in God's hands. God knows your, 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 your future. And before that person came, you were living. So you, it does not mean that your life is uh, stopped. So, and uh, I'll keep telling you that uh, better a failed relationship than a, a miserable marriage. You will make it remain strong. Just encourage yourself. Take time. Don't rush. Seek counseling. Just talk to people. Thank you so much. And thank you so much for watching. And have more video on relationship. Go on my YouTube channel. Uh, subscribe and go on the playlist. You'll be able to see a lot of messages on relationship. I want you to succeed in your relationship. The best relationship is your relationship with yourself. If you love yourself, if you accept yourself, no matter what comes on your way, you'll be able to deal with it. And I can tell you, you will make it. There is no need for you to hate yourself or hate other people. Don't hate yourself after being hurt. Remain strong, you will make it. I'm Shabi Hamuleng here. Please subscribe, share, and comment. You are such an amazing person.